there's some breaking news coming in. The plea filed in Supreme Court challenging these arrests. Uh, prominent citizens and some of academicians and supporters of those arrested have moved the apex court. Uh, the hearing is likely to take place 10.30 a.m. this morning. This is a big development taking shape uh, here. Post on Republic TV, a plea has been filed in the Supreme Court of India by Romila Thapa, prominent historian, and several others challenging these arrests against urban nationals. The plea will be heard by the Supreme Court of India at 10.30 a.m. Hashtag India versus Maoist is the biggest uh, uh, story here. This uh, morning, in fact, uh, Ridham Anand Bhardwaj, our legal editor, and Nalini Sharma, our legal correspondent, are closely monitoring this story from the Supreme Court of India. But this is a big development taking shape. Plea against the arrests filed by Romila Thapa. And in fact, uh, if I can go directly across to our legal editor, Ridham Anand Bhardwaj. Ridham, what's the latest that you are picking up? Certainly, they are not going to leave the legal fight. Yesterday, they approached the Delhi court. Uh, uh, and now, they are moving the Supreme Court of India and a crucial plea is going to be heard at 10.30 a.m. What's expected? Well, Aditya, it's likely that that plea could be heard around us. There's already action that started the Delhi High Court. In roughly 20 minutes from now, possibly those two pleas could be heard. One in the Delhi High Court, one in the Supreme Court. In the Delhi High Court, we are going to see Gautam Navlakha's plea coming up. This is against his arrest that had happened and they had stopped that. The Delhi High Court had stayed it for one day. They said, we'll go through the documents today. In the Supreme Court, there is a likely plea that's going to be mentioned at 10.30 a.m. today that's going to be filed by by Romila Thapar and others. This is going to be against the arrest of these human rights so-called defenders. This plea is going to state that all these actions that have taken place yesterday against these people is arbitrary. Now what we have to see is this kind of three-pronged attack that has been taken place by this lobby, whether it's going to pay heed or not. In the Delhi High Court, it's Gautam Navlakha's plea that's coming up. Tomorrow in the Chandigarh High Court, it's going to be Sudha Bhardwaj's case that's going to be heard. In the Supreme Court today at 10.30, we're also going to hear a general plea that's going to be mentioned, whether it's going to be taken up or not, we have to see. But behind this is, of course, Indira Jaising, a top legal eagle. We've also seen Prashant Bhushan, who's going to be there. Brinda Grover for Sudha Bhardwaj, who was sitting with her. So all these people as a whole are trying to maintain right. that these are so-called human rights defenders and they need to be defended. Urban Naxals as a whole have to be questioned here. We've been trying to say, and the, gov the police people who've been here, rather, they have only said one thing. There was a conspiracy hatched by them under the Unlawful Activities Prevention Act that needs to be probed.